Hi, welcome back. I'm wondering if this Rock Pal 60 watt solar panel is going to be able to charge my Helltech mesh pocket and also charge my Galaxy S23. So stay tuned to see the results. So we just unboxed the Helltech mesh pocket. It's a QI2 power bank, so it does the MagSafe charging and it's got a mesh taftic node inside of it. This is the 5000 mAh unit. And I want to see if it can charge my Galaxy S23. After the unbox, I didn't charge the mesh pocket at all. I just put my Galaxy S23 on it. And it got up to 92% and I reached the end of the battery. We'll take a look. Yeah, so the, the S23 has a remarkably large battery on it. And you see, I got that uh, mesh pocket down to 3.4 volts. You don't want to go any lower than that. Now it's Saturday morning, 7 a.m. I got this 60-watt uh, foldable solar panel, and I want to see if I can charge my mesh pocket and charge my Galaxy S23 again. Yeah, the S23 is run down to 22%, so I need to charge it. So first I went USB on the solar panel side to USB-C on the mesh pocket. We'll see it actually turns on the device that way. Yeah, there we go. Let's wait for Meshtastic to load here. It takes a second for that to boot up. Okay, there, Meshtastic's come up. So now we can actually monitor the charging activity in the Meshtastic app. We can see it's 42%, 3.76 3 volts. I'm going to take the dogs out and let's get a weather report. Seems to be a beautiful overcast day today. All right, so I went from USB to USB-C. Uh, I think the USB-C port on these solar panels more efficient as at charging. And you see I'm at 4.4 volts now, just uh, two and a half hours late since I started. And I think now it's time to start trying to charge my Galaxy S23. Yeah, so it actually, the mesh pocket lets you charge the mesh pocket while you're charging other devices from the mesh pocket. Yeah, you see there, you heard the gong, and it's charging, starting out at 22%. The voltage drops right away, 4.35. Checking the temperatures to make sure we don't exceed the ratings for these devices. Yeah, the uh, mesh pocket's rated to like 45 degrees centigrade, I think 55 degrees centigrade for storage. When you're using the MagSafe charging, it does heat up a little too, but we're still well under those tolerances right now. Let's send a test message. Yeah, that's my other node in the other <laughs> other end of the house there. Yeah, Longfast is, is empty now. Make sure to watch my video about how everybody's leaving Longfast and going somewhere, <laughs> going to a different modem preset. Messages sent and received. Yeah, and you can see the mesh pocket is still charging and it's holding a charge at 4.4 volts while it's doing the MagSafe charging on the Galaxy S23. So this is going pretty well. So at 11 a.m. the temperatures got a little hot even though the devices were in the shade. We went to 48 degrees centigrade. So I brought them into the house and we're going to continue charging the Galaxy S23. It made it to 54%. And so I'm just going to charge off of the uh, Meshtastic power bank. And it's 1236 p.m. I'm checking in. I'm at 89%. Yeah. All right. And the mesh pocket's holding up there. 25%, 3.68 volts. 108 p.m. The Galaxy S23 hits 100%. I'm at 3.6 volts on the mesh pocket. So essentially, I accomplished what I intended to do. I wanted to charge the mesh pocket, test the mesh-tastic aspect. It's really more efficient to charge these power banks off of a larger solar battery. And this one's hooked up to those panels in the window. And it really didn't take very long to get charged back up to the full capacity, 4.5 volts here. So now I'm going to run this. Stay tuned for the next video. We're going to see how long it'll run on that charge from last Saturday. Yeah, you see here in the app, it's at 4.44. Look for the link down below. 
to the product page. There's also a discount code in the description down below. They got a 5,000 MAH, 10,000 MAH, get the right frequency band for your region. Kind of excited about that project product. Okay, leave a comment down below. Give this video a like, and before you go watch more of my Helltech Meshtastic videos, or, you know, I've got like a whole playlist of solar panels and solar batteries as well. So you could check those out. But before you go, please click on subscribe. Thank you very much.